Hi to all, welcome to my class number 3, Constructions, Chapter 11 of Class 10. Today I am going to discuss to construct a triangle similar to a given triangle as per given scale of factor. This is the second type. The last class we constructed a triangle smaller than the given triangle. Now we are going to construct a triangle larger than the given triangle with as per the given scale factor. Here is a question. Construct a triangle with the sides 5 cm, 6 cm and 7 cm and then another triangle whose sides are 5 by 3rd of the corresponding side of the first triangle. Let me draw a rough figure for this triangle. Here I took the triangle as triangle ABC with AB 5 cm, BC 6 cm and AC 7 cm. Construct BC is equal to 6 cm. To get A, take 5 cm radius and with center B, radius 5 cm, draw an arc. Now, with the center C, radius 7 cm, draw an arc to intersect the previous arc. This intersecting point will be A. Now, join AB and AC. Now, you have to draw a ray BX making an acute angle with BC opposite to the side of vertex A. Now, locate five points on BX, say B1, B2, B3, B4 and B5, such a way that B, B1 is equal to B1, B2 is equal to B2, B3 is equal to B3, B4 is equal to B3, B5. Now in 5 by 3, the small number is 3. So we have to join B3 to C in this case. Now you have to draw a line parallel to B3C through B5. To want the intersect BC, so we have to extend BC. So, let me extend BC and to draw a parallel line through B5 parallel to B3C with the center B3, draw an arc with the same radius with the center B5 draw another arc now measure the length of arc drawn with the center B3 now with the same radius with this intersecting point as center Cut the second arc. Now join B5 and that intersecting point. Join. Let this line intersect BC, extended BC at a C dash. Now we have to draw a line parallel to CA through C dash intersecting BA produced at A dash. So we have to produce BA. Now 
with the center C any radius draw an arc now with the center C dash with the same radius draw another arc now measure length of this arc or op in the same angle cut it now join c dash with that in the setting point c dash to that intersection let this intersect extended ba at a dash now a dash b c dash is the required triangle now let us see the steps of construction draw triangle abc with ab 5 cm bc 6 cm ac 7 cm this is the first step second step draw any ray bx making an acute angle with bc on the side opposite to the vertex a step 3 locate five points b1 b2 b3 and b4 and b5 on bx so that b b1 is equal to b1 b2 is equal to b2 b3 is equal to b3 b4 is equal to b b4 b5 step 4 join b3 to c and draw a line through b5 parallel to b3 c in the set in the extended line segment bc at c dash step 5 draw a line through c dash parallel to ca in the setting extended line segment ba at a dash then a dash b c dash is the required triangle now let us see the justification of this construction here triangle abc and a triangle a dash b c dash are similar because angle b is equal to angle b common angle c is equal to angle c dash corresponding angles angle a is equal to angle a dash again corresponding angles therefore by a a a similarity these two triangles are similar if triangles are similar we can write its corresponding sides are proportional so we can write ab by a dash b is equal to ac by a dash c dash is equal to bc by b c dash but but look at the figure bc by b c dash it is equal to 3 by b c dash is equal to 5 so it is 3 by 5 so b c dash by b c we can write this 5 by 3 therefore we can write the relation a dash b by ab is equal to a dash c dash by ac is equal to b c dash by bc is equal to 5 by 3 that means the sides of a dash b c dash is 5 by 3 of the sides of triangle abc that is all for today's class have a nice day